writer and executive producer, has conquered the entertainment industry with hits such as Grace Under Fire, Sybil, and Dharma and Greg. His current series, Two and a Half Men, The Big Bang Theory, Woo! and Mike and Molly are the top comedies on television. Please welcome Chuck Lorre. Well, I get to follow Paul Ryan. Yes. <laughs> I wrote something on the drive over. <laughs> I have long believed that we as human beings are genetically inclined to elevate and worship those of us we deem to be very beautiful or very talented. John Cryer is both. I further believe that we elevate and worship because we are somehow comforted by our adoration. It makes us feel good. Of course, Oh, I further believe that we elevate in worship because we are comforted by our adoration. It makes us feel good. Of course, when we want to feel really good, we crucify our anointed ones. Or even better, watch them crucify themselves. With that in mind, we gather here today to elevate and worship John Cryer. John, as of this moment, with the awarding of a star on the hallowed Hollywood Walk of Fame, you are now one of our gods. You're on the pedestal. The entire world is looking up your omnipotent nose. And John, we like what we see. Going forward, don't feel pressured to behave perfectly. Always keep in mind that your newfound status as one of the immortals on our cultural Mount Olympus allows you to screw up beyond comprehension. Should you get arrested in a rented car with a transvestite hooker? Or get caught in bed with a live boy or a dead girl? Should you fall into the spiral of drug addiction and destroy your life and all the loved ones around you, know that we will love you all the more. In fact, nothing would please the folks filming this more than were you to step up to the microphone, unzip your fly, and wiggle your business at them. <laughs> But seriously, and yes, but seriously is the only way I can segue into the heartfelt part. I hope you know how truly loved you are on Two and a Half Men. We have all stood in awe for years at your enormous talent, your work ethic, your amazing, amazing comic instincts. But what really needs to be celebrated here today is your common decency, your professionalism, your sweet, easygoing nature, your humility, and your humanity. All of which you have consistently demonstrated in both good times and bad. I thought long and hard on the ride over <laughs> how to use this opportunity to heap praise upon you. And the best way I know to do it is simply to say that my life, the lives of everyone on the show, and the lives of millions and millions of people who have been watching the show are made better because of you. So, with the awarding of this star, we thank you. Uh, I think I can speak for everyone when I say how happy we are to see you, John Christ, uh, Jesus Christ, John Cryer, receive this great honor. We love you.